mark on the face of Andre Ewell. Charles Jordan is five significant strikes away from hitting the century mark. Well, six according to the graphic. And that is the most damage that Ewell has taken since joining the UFC. There it is, 100. I like how Jordan is going on after the body. That was a powerful knee. Oh, that hurt him. That hurt him. Yeah, you're right. You saw that body language, Michael? Oh, yeah. Oh, spills backwards. Oh, look at Jordan that. Jordan starting to feel himself, himself a little bit. Yep. Yeah, he just cracked the fence. You will wisely got out of the way of that one. He's going to spill and Oh, he got him. Well, Jordan will say, in my head, I don't have 15 minutes to win. I got 15 minutes to get a finish. He's got a, less than a minute to do so. And Ewell's got 50 seconds to stay alive. Yeah, these are good knees here. Still going to the body. These are all legal. He can still go to the head. You see no hands down on the mat here from Yule. Oh, that one landed flush. Mark Smith stepping in for the warning. Oh, the face is open right there. That's really nice. Oh, he's landing with the tip of the knee as well. Th these aren't five. This is patella to face. Yeah, you see how he pulls yeah. back just enough to be able to get the yeah. point of the knee right in there. Is it's that close? You know, when yeah, you're that close it's it, hard to land it, but look at this. Oh, man. Targeting the face perfectly. Oh! oh. One final oh. fight for Shortan, who goes spin kick. What a shot. But it might as well have been for Charles Jordan, who's pumped up the apex. Under a minute now to go in round one. I'd like to see Mariano use some butterfly hooks. I mean, look at his look at his legs. Like put those in the into the groin of the nutter to try to create some space. Dig some underhooks, some some butterflies, put the feet on the hips, put your feet on the chest, something. But sitting here with your long legs and letting Venado sit in your guard and punch you doesn't look like fun to me. making these ground strikes count here to the end of round one. There's the space that Mariano needs to create. See how he's putting the feet up. Venata pushes right through it. Mariano staying on the back, north-south position here. Venata's gonna switch to a key lock and go for the finish here. That's it, that's it. Oh, he's back. That's a tap. Lando Venata, late in round one, gets the submission win. Pure double wow. from Lando Venata. Incredible, I mean, that was a Perfect display of technique from the top position on a man who's not using space to get up.